Hello everyone. Well, this time I'm selling a tiny, well, not tiny, and a small linear actuator and uh, stepped motor. This, I believe, is a two-phase stepped motor. I'm gonna sell probably three or four of these, and the first thing I want to tell you is the motor move inside. There is nothing wrong with it. Everyone is the same way. Maybe it's because you know this is the motor is inside to this housing. So if you see if I move it, nothing happened and uh, it's not loose or it's not even move. Uh, you know this the shaft anything. It's just part of the design of the motors. It's very important to point in that. Um, because all the four motors are exact same. Okay, um, the the treading is a steel. See, it's a steel with a coating of Teflon for um, you know for durability. And it's got a tiny end bushing. I mean and bearing to mounting this is with a little the the tiny the tiny bearing has a little is end one so you insert in the in the in your in your plate and hold it and uh, the this part is made perhaps from nylon and they have a two mountains holes, and it's got a little um, this little part is for the stop for signal stop if you use any kind of uh, um, micro switch or optic switch or whatever. Uh, the the threads are 16 threads per inch so it's two inches is link length of the screw the motor diameter is uh, one inch um, one two three one inch five Eights. one inch five eighths a little bit over and then the thickness is about seven eight of an inch this doesn't show any just the number it's a Seiko as the number is three zero six two six two and doesn't show any voltage and uh, so you have to you know you have to try with different voltages but what I, I'm using a driver to to make sure it's working actually this is a very tiny wires, I mean very short wires. So this is for a this connection is for testing, but I went I wait I'm going to include it the combination of the uh, this go to the motor like you see here and the other part going here and you, you actually can mount in, in a board or you can actually do what I do in my test what, uh, solder right there uh, the first two wires are the first phase A, A minus, B, B minus and the two browns are the common or center tops that's what I said to face so well let me turn it on it's kind of noisy the the fan of the driver but I want to show you it's very good and it's actually 
in good conditions so let's see what's happened see right away is, is, so let's uh, let's do a job backwards and I want to do it so I want to put uh, I want to do some commands to make sure let's see it's supposed to stop at this early time see it stops Let's go forward, backwards. That's indexing. So it's running pretty good, and it's. Uh, I drop the velocity, and it's moving like a one step. You, you hardly see it. Anyway, um, well, I just want to sell for twelve ninety nine and three fifty for shipping. And what I said, I want to include the two connectors. To make it easy for you um, to, you know, to make longer lines of wire for your driver. What I said is two-phase motor. The only thing you need is a driver with to have a step direction. That's it. The center tops. If you have a driver A and B only, and then you have to tie it out, tie the. Um, the center tops together and you use just the four wires if you have just a driver with this a, a plus a and b so the center tops going together and they're not connected so twelve ninety nine three dollar fifty for shipping and I will include the brand new connectors So thank you for watching and I will take some pictures.